To tell us about an outdoor Christmas market, we have in the studio here the organizer who happens to be Natalie Laverne. Hello and welcome. Thank you, Doreen. It's great to be back. I love your dress. Thank you. And it's Christmassy. Well, it's Christmassy because we're talking Christmas, so yeah. <laughs> you have polar bears, you have deer, you have icebergs, all sorts of things. Yeah. So yeah. yes, Christmas. Yeah. It's hard to believe, but yeah, it's it's coming. It's, it's coming. coming. And I feel bad to talk about Christmas before Remembrance Day and before Halloween, but it's to be prepared. Yes. Let's say. Yes, it is. It is. It's, it's, yeah, you have to get ready for it and it's coming. Yeah. So what are the dates? So November 25, 26, it's a Saturday, Sunday, one month just before Christmas at the Brockville Shopping Center. So Stingers or the Zillers Plaza. Yes, yes. And what number would this be? Because you've been there before. So yes. how many years have you had this market? So four years. Four uh, years. Yeah, and it's the third year at the at shopping. At the shopping center. Yes. Oh yes. my heavens. So is there an admission fee? No. It's totally free. Okay. Uh, it's totally free. Bring the family. What we're asking or suggesting to people, it's close to Christmas. If you have some extra food or are you feeling like grabbing some at, you know, the grocery store to bring it for the food bank, yes. we're going to be having a big box to hopefully bring to the food banks. Oh, good. Oh, that's yeah. so thoughtful. That's very nice. That's very nice that you're doing that. And so now what time should people start to arrive? So vendors are going to be setting up in the morning, but it's starting at 11 till 3. 11 until 3, okay. Because yes. last year was a snowstorm and I got stuck in the driveway and had to shovel and call the company. <laughs> so I thought, you know what? We're just going to leave people time to shovel everything, be prepared. There's going to be a storm uh, <laughs> and come from 11 to 3. You know what? Having you say that, it'll probably be a beautiful weekend. <laughs> that would be awesome. <laughs> so tell us about the vendors. Like last year, what did you? What sort of vendors were there? Uh, so we had jewelry vendors. We had food vendors. Like you want to get fudge and cookie and all the sweets. You yes. know. Yes. Um, there was also jams and 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 yeah. And uh, there was some uh, decor, so you want to have like that little Christmas tree that you mm -hmm. just shovel in your car and you put right. in the front and that's it. <laughs> um, there was uh, games. Uh, this year we have uh, we have the Association Champlain that are going to be uh, selling uh, Tire Sainte Catherine. Mm -hmm. And um, so, yeah, plenty of different vendors, but we're still looking for vendors because I'm half full. So I would have I would love to have the second half of yes. the space. Yes, which, yes, which is understandable. And it's outdoors. Yes, so, so be prepared. You have a yeah, be prepared, be dressed for it. Uh, but also realize that there's a lot of room there too. You've got a lot of the parking. Yes, so, yeah. there's a lot of room, mm -hmm. and some people are saying, "Oh, it's outdoor." But honestly, we're gonna have live music on both days, so it's really nice. There's now the great uh, Jamaican kitchen, you know, right there yes. so to warm you up with some, you know, really jerk poutine. If you haven't <laughs> tried it, try the jerk poutine. And and we're going to have like a coffee vendor on site too. Good. Um, we're going to miss the wish upon a donut because they've closed because well. that was my go to during that weekend, you know, like <laughs> okay. stop by the donut. <laughs> Um, but there's going to be food vendors too, yeah. and it's always a good time. And you know, it's winter in Canada, so you have to just embrace it and dress for it. We're used to it. Yeah. We're used to it. So hey, why not outdoor? Absolutely. Yeah. Just yes. dress warm. That's all. Maybe there's going to be mold wine. <laughs> <laughs> that would be nice too. Yes. yes. Now, is there going to be um, uh, someone that uh, that or some organization that's going to be having a fundraiser? Is that taking yes, place? Yes. And I'm missing the name of the organization. I'm so sorry, but there's an uh, organization that's going to be there. The 24, the 25, the 26 at the old fabric land and okay. they have their own promotion they contacted me and i was like yes let's do something together and now i have a blank but oh, that's great. yes that's there's okay. going to be that and potentially saint john bosco is also going to do draw uh they oh. came last year yes and they had like a good time so they were crazy enough to come back this year <laughs> yes they want to they want to be involved they want to have fun yes no and it's why great not? why yeah. not you know it's the place for i think 
uh, groups in our community to just come and and to set up and to be there with the people and mm-hmm. and get themselves over there. Like I'm glad that the Association Champlain is coming and Saint John Bosco is coming too. Yes, yes, yeah. and and you know as you say, it's only uh, a month away before Christmas. Yeah. So come out and do some Christmas shopping. You know, um, talk to these vendors, see what they have. Yeah. It's always, it's always nice. You see, uh, unique things are what you see at a lot of these markets. Absolutely. Yeah. So we yeah. have makers and we have other vendors. You okay. know, we have people that are going to be selling scentsies and Tupperware and sweet legs. But we have like a big bunch of makers that are going to be doing green reason, sweet oh, and, and yes. lots of things. And it's funny because earlier this week I received a text message from a girl saying, Hey, there was that lady we were was doing mittens mm-hmm. two years ago. Can you please give me a referral? So two years later, it's still going on. So it's not because you've been a vendor last year or you're thinking about maybe doing it this year that mm-hmm. it's not going to bring you other sales in the future. Yeah, you never know. You never you know. You just never know. And with mittens and things like that, homemade are the best. They yeah. really, really are. They're so nice and warm. Yeah. Yes. So the dates again are... Uh, November 25th, 26th, so it's a Saturday mm-hmm. and Sunday, Sunday of November. Time? Yeah. Three, no, 11 to 3. Yeah, 11 3 to, to 11, 11. It's going to be hell of a party. <laughs> 11 to 3. <laughs> and it's going to be at the Brockville Shopping Mall, so mm-hmm. where Stinger is, but we, it's outdoors. So, uh, yeah, it's close to Fabricland. Dress warm, come and I have fun. Grab some hot apple cider, some hot chocolate. Um, who Just knows, enjoy. maybe we're going to have like games for kids. And, and you've got music. You're going to have music, got music, so it's going to be yeah. wonderful. Yes. Spencer, Sharp and uh, Brian is going to be there. So, no, it's going to be it's going to be great. Yeah, I think it will be. Thank you for coming in, sitting down, Thank telling you us for about this. You're going to get us all Christmassy. That's what you're going to do, right? Yes, ho, yeah. ho, ho. <laughs> if you're looking for me on site, I normally have the Santa hat. Because so, I'm five feet long, so <laughs> you have to look for the center. <laughs> Thanks for coming in. Thanks. We'll be right back. <laughs>